Hi guys, um, welcome to this series of lessons on AWF Kinesis. I'm Johnny Chivers. I am a professional data engineer, uh, Monday to Friday. Um, I'm five times AWS certified. And I have nothing more in my spare time than doing some free videos to pass on the knowledge. Um, this is going to be a, a, a multi-part series on um, AWS Kinesis where we're going to build a real-time streaming app and learn about the service at the same time. So I think there's nothing better than learning and doing at the same time and avoiding all those boring PowerPoints that you sit through and the knowledge really doesn't sink in. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a real-time streaming app using all three AWS Kinesis services, Data Streams, Data Analytics and Firehose. Um, it's going to cost a few dollars. Um, so when I've done this in practice, it's cost me about three or four dollars, no more than five. So if you're very, very careful and turn off all the streams when we're not using them, then it shouldn't cost you too much money. Um, obviously, if you do higher volumes of data or leave them running, it's going to cost you more. And then by the end of this video series lessons, um, I'm really hoping that you get the fundamental understanding of what data streams is. I start to build that knowledge base heading towards the search in the data specialties or even like the normal AWS um, professional architect exams. Um, so getting started, what we're going to do, as I alluded to, is build a real-time streaming app using the services. So I'm just going to draw out a little diagram on the iPad here and it'll build up um, the architecture pattern of what we're going to do. So here's a little diagram I drew earlier. So in lesson one up here, what we're going to do is use the Kinesis Data Generator, which is a free AWS service. Um, and that lets us uh, produce data without having to worry about it ourselves. So we're just going to utilize that service inside our account. And we're going to use that to put data onto a Kinesis data stream. And that's the first AWS service we're going to encounter. Theory-wise, we'll cover what a data stream is. Um, we'll look at the producers. So we're going to look at the Kinesis producer library and the Kinesis um, SDK as well. Cover that in theory. And we'll look at shards and, and uh, how much data you can pump on the stream. If that doesn't make any sense right now, don't worry about it. Um, we'll cover it as we go. Lesson two, which is down here, what we're going to do is use DynamoDB, which is a serverless database and a Lambda function as a consumer and put that data into Dynamo. Now, if that doesn't make much sense right now, um, it will at the end of the lesson series. So again, we'll, we'll cover what a consumer is, we'll look at a bit of Lambda, we'll look at a bit of DynamoDB. Nothing better than doing to really, to really reinforce what you're learning. And then in lesson three, which is up here, what we'll do is we'll use this is Firehose with my little dodgy Firehose here, and um, we'll stream that data straight in to a uh, S3 bucket up here. So I'll just draw that line on now very quickly. So we'll take that up and draw that into that S3 bucket. And then in lesson four, which I'll just draw a line right there. So in lesson four, we'll use Kinesis Data Analytics. Um, you stream off this in real time. And then that will allow us actually to do real analytics on the data. So we'll put a query over the data and we'll do counts and things like that as it's coming through. And those results sets of those counts and aggregates will be stored in S3. So we're looking at four lessons. So we're going to go through lesson one, where we look at Kinesis data streams and producers in depth. Lesson two, where we look at consumers in depth. Lesson three, where we use Firehose to stream straight into an S3 bucket. And then lesson four, where we're going to perform real-time data analytics on that stream data that we're bringing out of the Kinesis data generator. So that's us for today. Join me in uh, Kinesis 101, uh, the lesson one up here, where we're going to look at the Kinesis gener data generator in the next video in this series. I've been Johnny Chivers. You can find all these resources for free on my website, www.johnnychivers.co.uk. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching.